Well, it's Tuesday again, it's the day of the full moon, or it's the day after the sun got halfway between the, uh, the solstice and the equinox. So, according to some calculations, that's the beginning, that's a change of season in this part of the world. It's winter. Took a little ride out at the edge of town today on the bus, which I do sometimes. That's looking out to the southeast out there, towards the general direction of uh, Serbia and Bulgaria and the Danube. There's even a couple of cows. Two, I can see two cows out there. Yep. So, what do we have today? What do we have today? We have today... I went and got measured again. Have the details in here somewhere. Hold on. Yep. So we got weighed and measured. And accordingly, suddenly uh, 1.73 meters tall instead of 1.71. Uh, it's nice to get back to my real height. Uh, one. 101, 119 over 84 for the blood pressure, 69 beats per minute for the heart, and the weight is 82.9 kilos, 82.9, we're getting somewhere at last, that's uh, 8 kilos, that's no longer hanging around. Um, okay, so we'll just do a little... Yes, autumn leaves. But that out there is part of the, uh, the, the Pannonian Plain. It's flat like that all the way into Serbia and keep you in the other direction or take you into Hungary. Um, yes, I'm sure in April. 1241 when the Mongols were here they, they were like at home oh it's flat oh goody it's no mountains um yep yeah. here we have uh, drainage <laughs> looks like the kids have been playing over there that is not a badger set um okay so that's about it except oh yes yes YouTube this morning came across a, a not very interesting video by some probably interviewing friends of the earth climate change and all the rest and it was just you know like a couple of minutes of the usual BS about uh, animal agriculture animal agriculture what's that I know what agriculture is, that's when you dig up the field and plow it and plant stuff in it and grow crops. Or maybe even trees, fruit trees. But, nay, 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 animal agriculture, that is uh, when I went to school, that was called pastoralism. Pastoralism, you know, like herds, herds, flocks. Herds of cattle, flocks of sheep, herds of goats, and flocks of geese and chicken and ducks and whatever else you might have been herding. Yes, you just sort of like looked after them, made sure they didn't get too cold, too hungry, too wet, too eaten, too stressed out, and let nature do its thing. Yeah, anyway, I'll pin that video down the bottom of this one because it's like, it just sort of like the kind of stuff that just should not be continually repeated because it's all wrong. I mean, you know, those people believe it because that's their religion. It's their doctrinal, doctrinal blah, blah, blah. It's their dogma. 
somebody told them something that sounded right to them and they accepted it without looking into it at all and got carried away with the emotional um, feel-good effect. I'm virtuous because... Blah, blah, blah. I'm virtuous because... Blah, blah, blah. Okay. That's enough for me. Another, another little look at the... Uh, yes, here's my...